Big Pi Network News Revealed. This just happened. Important to know. In the midst of the emergence of new altcoins today, what makes this one stand out from the rest? Also, right here in this video, check out what makes the biggest news the company shared on its social media account just this June. Welcome to Crypto Live. Please like the video and subscribe to our channel to stay updated on our upcoming videos about cryptocurrencies. This new cryptocurrency network, launched by Stanford graduates, claims to have what it takes to succeed where Bitcoin has failed. A way to bring crypto to everyone without energy-guzzling blockchains that harm the environment. As we all know, Pi Network is a digital currency project that aims to keep crypto mining accessible since Bitcoin has been defined as a first-generation currency that is out of reach for the everyday user. The Pi Network is a new kind of social cryptocurrency created by three Stanford PhDs and graduates. Kukalis, Fan, and McPhillip say it's so lightweight and easy to use that it runs on mobile devices. It only took a few months after the Pi Network launched on Pi Day, March 14th of 2019, for the project to surpass 500,000 installs. And even then, there were active members in over 180 countries. According to McPhillip, Pi's head of community, its growing popularity is a result of its relative accessibility. In an interview with Decrypt, he explained that Pi is powered by the social network of its users. He said Bitcoin continues to be inaccessible to most people due to the high cost of mining and the need for highly specialized technical knowledge. What's worse, he further added, are the carbon emissions produced by that mining and the damage they do to the environment. He explained that Bitcoin's proof-of-work consensus protocol depends on nodes using a lot of electricity to compete to be the first to solve a math equation. Pi, on the other hand, utilizes the Stellar Consensus Protocol, or SCP, which relies on the involvement of many nodes to determine transaction validity. And to acquire consensus, nodes must communicate with each other, requiring significantly less computing power. A Pi network consists of what the team calls security circles. These groups are made up of different users who have been recommended by their peers. They will then be permitted to validate future transactions in Pi's blockchain if they're deemed trustworthy by other members of their group. The Pi network is kept safe and funds in the network are secured this way. Users are selected for membership based on a series of tests, and those who are admitted have demonstrated a commitment to the network's safety. The Pi community can also mine new tokens right from smartphones, a process that requires minimal battery power and is relatively low cost. And following three mining sessions, members can start creating their own security circles, which are typically composed of three to five trusted members, the miner trusts, to not execute fraudulent transactions. McPhillip explained that individuals prove that their security circle members are trustworthy each day they log onto the application during the current beta phase. In addition to creating mechanisms to ensure people have something at stake in vouching for each other, they are designing testnet and mainnet to make sure everyone has an equal opportunity to participate. Pi Network has done what few crypto projects manage. It has captured the imagination of everyday consumers. So, is Pi Crypto worth anything? To learn more about this, stay tuned, and let us know your thoughts by leaving some comments below. Some analysts have been analyzing the future price of this digital coin based on supply and demand. You can also view our previous videos, but here are some ideas for you. The project says that, when it first launched, the base mining rate stood at 1.6 Pi an hour, having to 0.8 pi once 100,000 users were onboarded, a further having to 0.4 pi an hour followed when 1 million users started using the app. And the latest slash to 0.2 pi an hour came after its user base swelled beyond 10 million. It is expected that the next having to 0.1 pi an hour will occur when the mainnet launches. The date for that remains unclear. Should pi ever reach 1 billion users, the reward will fall to zero. But is the Pi coin legit? It's important to note that some people making Pi coin predictions aren't necessarily concerned with its future value. They're more interested in whether the project is authentic. 
people who have downloaded the PyCoin app tend to make the most optimistic predictions about the coin's price. Some have suggested that a coin might be worth anywhere between $10 and $100 right now. However, there is no evidence to support this claim, and the Pi Network's developers have not released much information about the project so far. Southeast Asia seems to be the most popular region for Pi Network. However, it has been said that blockchain experts speaking with the Vietnamese newspaper VN Express have cast doubt on the platform's legitimacy, particularly since users don't have access to their private keys. Does Pi Network have a future? It will be easier to make Pi Network price predictions for 2021 if the mainnet is ever launched, and the cryptocurrency users have been mining ends up being distributed to them. And it's going to be a wait and see until then. The debut of Phase 3 should signal the beginning of this waiting game. As is the case with a myriad of blockchain projects, very little information is available about Pi Network Online, including on crypto news sites. It's possible that Pi Network will be just what we expect it to be that it will launch, that users will receive their coins, and that the cryptocurrency will have a great deal of value. Due to the fact that it was founded by Stanford graduates, the project has the appearance of credibility. While crypto projects have surpassed expectations before, it is also a sector dominated by scams, scammers, and pyramid schemes, as seen with the collapse of OneCoin. According to some estimates, about $19.4 billion, or 14.4 billion pounds, or 16.4 billion euros, may have been stolen by the time OneCoin went under, and several people ended up getting prosecuted for their involvement. And for the value of Pi Crypto in 2025, how much will it be? We must emphasize that we cannot predict the price of Pi Coin for 2025 due to the fact that the cryptocurrency has not yet been listed anywhere, which makes any technical or fundamental analysis impossible. Since it is free to download and mine over the Pi Network, I mentioned in our previous video that maybe it might be worth a try if it does not cost anything yet, only a little bit of your time every day. It is important to stay on the lookout for scams. Despite the fact that the Pi Network is free, you should not rule out the possibility that it could be benefiting from its users in other ways. Thus, I hope this video has answered some of your questions about Pi Network, including whether Pi is a scam, why users can't access their crypto yet, and why users need a referral to join, when Pi will be listed on crypto exchanges, when Phase 3 is due to launch, whether user data is being used for financial gains, and how much Pi is currently worth, and why ads were added to the app. So, what is the biggest news that the company has posted on their Twitter account? Almost 19 million pioneers have already signed up to participate in our program, according to a tweet from the company last June 1st. In addition, the message tells us to mine as fast as we can while we can. After the main net and when there are 100 million engaged pioneers, mining rates may have or fall to zero. Therefore, we must not miss out on it in the end. That's all for this video about crypto, and thank you for watching. If you would like to receive updates on the crypto market, make sure you click the subscribe and bell button.